Welcome to the WH Game Hideout. This is Sweetstone Holmes, and we're going to play some Bayonetta on the PC in stereoscopic 3D. So if you have red and blue glasses, get them on now. If you don't want to see it in 3D, then sorry, because this is in Anaglyph 3D, and I can't change it to 2D right now. So you're stuck with it. <laughs> You'll have to wait till I do a real 3D one and then you can turn it to 2D. But anyway, let's go ahead and start the game, I guess. Since it is a little after my usual time. Make sure my microphone is everything is working. Because last stream I had a little bit of problems with the microphone. This is Anaglyphic 3D live stream is right up my alley. Hey, Iron Crow, how are you doing? Yeah, I was determined, bound and determined to play Bayonetta in 3D because I've got this on the, the PS3 and it was one of the first things I actually streamed, which is kind of funny. But it just came out for PC, so I said, you know what? I tried to find my disc and I said, nah, I'll go ahead and get it for PC and we can play it in 3D, so... I tried it with the Tridef 3D drivers and it didn't work because it starts in a window for some reason and then goes to full screen so the 3D the Tridef can't hook into it for some reason but Nvidia seems to work it does kind of make the uh, screen is the um, the uh, yeah these cutscenes are really bad but it's all right once it gets into the game it gets good uh, the game frame rate, that's what I'm talking about, gets a little bit scratchy in NVIDIA 3D. But it's not too bad. I tried to lower everything down so it wasn't, it's at a minimum. Long since erased from the records of time, there once existed two European clans who served as overseers of history for the powers that be. The Umbrologists. Well, they don't tell you what to do in this area, and so you're just like, huh? Oh. Like when I first started, I didn't know what in the world was going the on. The clans paid each other great respect, and their efforts to maintain the balance between them defended the just passage of time. Yet one day, that balance was toppled. This is a lot like playing uh, DMC in 3D. It's really cool. There's a lot of floating stuff in the sky. Ooh, I didn't avoid that very well. The once harmonious Actually, the frame rate's not bad right now. Disagreement and stoke it was pretty bad before. I don't know what was going on. Oh, I was in OBS 17, that's what happened. The conflict between the Umbra and the Lumen wow. threw all guy. of Europe into a chaotic and loop of battle. Ambush, assassination, and casualty. Oh, watch this. It was truly a move. <laughs> She's got a gun in her boot. Fight the tremendous radiance of God shining upon Ow. them. The Lumen Sages were gradually weakened by the assault of the secretive Dark Witches. Years after the balance was lost, the war had ended in Umbra Witches' favor. Hey. This right here is a lot like DMC. Except that you actually get to play it on DMC, whereas on that it was just a cutscene. Cut You'll really enjoy DMC, I'm pretty sure. Except the story is kind of, eh. Yeah. The, the first half of it is really bad, but the second half gets pretty good. Or the ending is good. Ooh. Their victory was short-lived. Yeah. Look at that Feeling giant the dragon. Oh, yep, that dra dragon Humans got me. began to condemn the remaining Umbra. They launched the witch hunts, rounding up the battle-weary witches with little resistance and subjugating those who wished to continue to tell what's going on sometimes. Human faith in the miracles the of their god pushed the witch that, hunts further. And soon you get all kinds of weird creatures like that in this game. Of the darkness were extinguished from the earth. All but one. Yeah, I knew he was going to say that somehow. Oh, I played this before, sorry. 
but they always say all but one. When they get real close to the screen, it gets really bad. It's not horrible, but it's pretty bad. Maybe they will make a uh, a mod for this. The three D rendering looks to be flawless right now. Yeah, the uh, in-game stuff is really good. Can't complain about that. But the the cut screen, uh, the cut scenes get a little weird. Like I said. I like that the cut scenes like this right here is actually in 3D. It's actually all rendered. I'm not sure if it's supposed to be jerking like that or not. I think it is because it's supposed to be an old film. Which I kind of dig. It's sort of a film noir type thing. Something is killing them, and nobody can see it, apparently. And it's a shadow on the wall. Is it something that this lady sent? Because this lady is a witch, just like the character that you play in the game. Or I play, I guess, I should say. Yeah, I'll go ahead and save it, I suppose. Yeah. What else do I want? Vegetable. Vegetable. <laughs> or vegetable. <laughs> yeah, it's funny. When I played this on the PS3, I was going, wow, this would be really good in 3D. <laughs> I never thought I would be actually playing it in 3D. So, cheers to Sega for releasing this on PC. I read the reviews on Steam and everybody said this is a flawless conversion to PC. Unlike some of Sega's other past mistakes, they actually got this really... They got this done right. I bet these guys never thought their names would be popping out of the screen. <laughs> or getting peed on, apparently. Uh, it, it looks like Humpty Dumpty I didn't need to see that. Even all egg men the destroyer gets scrambled in the end. It's the penguin. Right? You know, I still don't get why the hell you drag me out here for these things. I just drop off the merchandise. Hey, bet you can't guess what He's today. got a ponytail. Ah, that's horrible. Reading the good lord's book ain't gonna do much. People been waiting for this asshole to get whacked for ages. Please. Hell, look around. There's no love lost for old Humpty Dumpty. But you gotta keep the outfit happy. We don't take care of him, they take care of us. And I prefer my shoes made out of rubber, not concrete. <laughs> That's a pretty nice scene. Today, eh? It's that kind of town. Without good hearted souls like us to put ah, these bastards six horrible. feet under, where'd Stop society it. be? Of course, the pace Don't do not that to me. So, uh, cut screens. Jesus, you really get into this shit, don't you? <laughs> That's one me, thing about this game. I don't know when it came out, but man, there was a lot of swearing in it. <laughs> For the time, I think it was a little overkill. <laughs> you can keep praying, but the only way this guy's meeting the Lord is if God's hungry for breakfast. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> Nobody's laughing. Speaking of hungry, we done here. My kids are baking me a birthday cake tonight. Cute Got her Elvis costume what. on. Well then, adios. Heck, this game never thought it would be in 3D. What the fuck? <laughs> They're here? For this douchebag? <laughs> ah, I hate this damn light. <laughs> I can't see a thing. Oops. Oh, the now he's cursed they? forever. You hearing me? You you can see them, can't you? I see them. Ah. They are instruments cut of screen. God. Cutscene. Descending upon His heavenly rays to earth. 
Oh my it's like when, God. You, when you say, take your glasses off now. <laughs> Dear Lord, grant us guidance and keep safe the souls of our loved ones for all eternity. We'll wait till this horrible 3D passes. There we go. Better now. The rain looks pretty good. Oh no! Oh, I thought that was gonna hurt. Ow. <laughs> Whoa. So this nun is beating up angels. It's Let just me tuck you in. Oh, I bet that's Bayonetta in the sky, isn't it? <laughs> that was a funny one. I'm not controlling this, by the way. It's still cutscene. Long cutscene. I'm gonna lose. I don't know Oh, now he's praying. <laughs> uh oh. He's loose. The juice is loose. Wait a minute. <laughs> what am I talking about? This guy. Neo. Next time you get your Whoa. hands on me, you better make sure I take press up. Now move out the way. If it ain't my good buddy Enzo, how about you nice get out of here? here? You die, and I'm gonna have to go back in that hole chasing after the money you owe me. They say they can't, you can't take it with you, but he has like $300 glasses on. you naughty little angels deserve a good banking. Okay. <laughs> Oh, man. Beautiful. Oh no. <laughs> the Japanese. Yeah, warning guys. <laughs> oh man. This game is thoroughly Japanese. Oh man, YouTube's probably gonna... <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> this game is just bizarre. <laughs> it's gonna get worse. <laughs> It'll get worse before it gets better. <laughs> oh, I, I see what you're saying. The 3D, yeah. It's uh, red and blue 3D, so yes. It's gonna look weird for those that don't have 3D glasses. But I must. Ah, I must cheeky. play this in 3D. Throwing me these cheap toys. Well, Don't worry about quality. You know, he's gonna sell him, sell you some good quantity. guns later. Oh, okay, he's gonna throw him, throw her some uh, golden guns or something. Oh, this is where she gets her boot guns or whatever. <laughs> this is still cutscene, guys. A long cutscene. I am not controlling this at all. I wish I was. Really cool. Of course, when you do control it. Oh man! <laughs> Blue and red guns. Yeah, I want LSD for sure. Yeah. Uh, it looks amazing in 3D, except for every once in a while it gets like that. That's horrible in 3D. But when it's when the camera's away a little bit. If you're just gonna watch, I'm putting you two to work. Whoa. Bam! 
man, where did he get that? That was your last call. No more shots from me to Bayonetta. Maybe this came out right about the time of the Matrix or something. Because <laughs> obviously he's like Neo. As long as there's music, Homeworld. I'll keep yeah. on dancing. <laughs> Oh, man. Okay, here we go. Now I'm controlling it. Now I can shoot and... Whoops. Oh, okay. Tutorial time. Beautiful. Oh, beautiful. Okay. That was easy. Okay, we can do combos. Alright. And we're doing a dodge. I'm pushing dodge. Oh, I see. It had to stop and make sure that I was doing it right. Oh, this is the tough one. We have to dodge just at the right time. There we go. And I can attack. Which time? Cool. Oh, I didn't dodge that too well. You can jump way up in the air and become a butterfly and shoot him. And you gotta get these halos because that's the currency of the game. Later that guy will sell you weapons and stuff. The camera's a little weird though, it's sort of pseudo controlled by the computer. Or in the case of the PS3 game console, when it was on PS3. It was funny, when I bought this game, it was it's sort of rare or whatever, and so I paid a, a fairly premium price to get it on PS3. And then, now it's on PC, and I'm sure that now I can't sell it on eBay for a very good price. <laughs> it's probably only going to go for maybe four bucks or something. Yeah, YouTube's not gonna like the the t uh, "Fly Me to the Moon" song, most likely. That's copyrighted. I'll sing it like uh, Sinatra, and that'll make it better. Fly me to the moon. Nah. I'm not gonna do that. I'm not gonna do it. <sighs> I like shooting them better than I like meleeing. I don't know why. Although, it's gonna be a long time if I don't start getting in here and doing it. Oh. <laughs> yeah. The frame rate's a little jerky here. I apologize, but it's probably the 3D that's doing that. Because the game runs very, very smooth. I ran it in 2D and it is. Just like everybody says, 60 frames per second, really nice. Just like on the console, or better. Also, you can pick out um, different kinds of uh, things on the PC, like uh, higher texture quality and anti-aliasing and SAOO or SA whatever that is. <laughs> SAAO? I think it's SAAO, which I had to turn off to get the 3D to work uh, very well. And I had to make the shadows low quality, which actually they look pretty good. Yeah, it's a little jerky right now. Now we got these weird angel heads. Am I stuck? Oh, it's going to a tutorial, that's what's going on. Yeah, I know how to shoot. Here, I'll shoot with my... With my Foot gun. Oh, this is a cool one. So you go. Yeah, I'll. Okay. Whoops, I guess I didn't do it right. Hmm, I did it for first time when I did it before. Now it's not. Hmm. -mm. 
so I have to do it at the same time. That's weird. It worked the first time I tried it. Hmm. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Rotate and press. Rotate and press. Yeah. There we go. Finally. Beautiful. Won't be using that much, I bet. <laughs> Grab the attack, you can point yourself around, you can shoot you wherever you want. That's cool. Alright. Now let's see if I can do it once. <laughs> Nope. <laughs> Can't. <laughs> Not really. Got some more of those weird angel things. <laughs> Which time? It's the witching hour. Which time are you referring to? Aw, didn't dodge that one too well. Mm, fruit Loops. <laughs> that guy's like stuck on there or something. Well, let's see if it doesn't mean. Miss the dodge. Kind of sad that Sir Rosser hasn't come by because he'd probably like to see this in Animus 3D as well. But he'll probably catch it on YouTube. I guess I should be talking a lot more so that I can kind of cover up the song. Oh, yeah, here we go. We'll do some bad 3D. But that's kind of cool right there. With the feather falling down. So you gotta go down here, apparently, and down there. Smoosh. Ah! Damn it! Who <laughs> did that? I just That's fought horrible. the damn thing. Well, I did, of course. Haven't you figured it out yet? There's no quarter for you in this world. What world are we talking about here? Perfect dodge. Could be all kinds of combos, but I'm probably not going to learn them all. Oh. Wow. Also, I think there's a targeting system like most games Ooh. of this type, like God of War and such. Hey, I finally got that <laughs> rotation thing to work, actually. Oh, that's the big one. I want to get near him right now. Or it. Whoa. Sorry, I got near him. I want to get near that. That's just it. Okay, dodge, dodge, dodge. Aww. Didn't quite make it. Alright. I'm not sure if you've got a life meter at this point or not. Oh, crud. I did a lot better the first time. I. Oh, wow. The camera really took a turn for the worse on that one. Alright. Oh, I was going to dodge, but it didn't work. That looks really cool, though. <laughs> All that stuff flying around. Woo, nice. Go in here and attack them. 
Wow. <laughs> I got a silver medal. That's a rare thing for me. Uh, Radon should be paying me for even touching these toys. You have any <laughs> idea how much this is gonna cost to fix? How the fuck do I always get wrapped up in this shit? Engine still purrs nicely. Now, about this little thing you've been looking into for me, Enzo. Let's have a quick chat. Actually, for the age of See, this game, to this have so many kind of like the, the little earrings and stuff flying off of her ears and, and you pieces of her hair flapping thing. in the wind it and stuff was pretty advanced. With you. you keep belly aching like that, and you're liable to wake Eggman from the dead. And I don't think either of you would like that. Oh, he's called Pac-Man? Catch you later, Bayonetta. Something tells me you're gonna need a rush on our special project before this shit hits the fan. Wait, Rodan. What about Eggman? Oh, Such he's not a Eggman. Popular chap. I bet they hate him down there as much as you did when he was up here. We just need to make sure he won't come crawling back when they kick him out. Nothing a flower bed can't fix. Fill her up. Okay, so Eggman is somebody else. You heard the man. Finish up in five minutes, or you're walking home to your cake and candles. What? Don't you leave me here? <laughs> I mean, see, there are those little dangly things off of her outfit. Wow, this loads a lot faster than PS3, I must say. On PS3, you had to sit there and, and you could kind of like practice your moves and things. Her feet are through the hole. I can see them bastards that did this to my car. Forget about it. Enzo, the road. Good 3D here. How can you be so calm? You're still getting I mean, it screwed works, but it's not great. <laughs> of all the low life scum in too deep and I can't adjust it or it'll adjust the whole game. Get wrapped up and in a fight bad. with God's messengers. Oh, no. <laughs> Dressed like a nun, too. When you end up in the afterlife, that's not going to be pretty. I can't <laughs> help it if I like the little outfits. The toys are nice. <laughs> Twenty years ago, you woke up stuck in a casket at the bottom of a lake. All you can remember is that you're a witch. But now, you're stuck because you gotta sacrifice our Halo-wearing friends every day or they'll drag your ass back down to hell. Uh, I know, I what if there's I a twist screwed, at the end and she's not really a witch? To slap around the divine for a living? That's really getting screwed. If I needed a biographer, you wouldn't be my first choice. I see to the funeral. You get me the information I asked for. That was our deal. Ha 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 ha! Come on now! Look at my poor car! I'm working for free after this! At least let me get a drink at Rodan's before you start drilling me. The info I got is good. It's gonna get you close to I gotta look up what year this game came out. And figuring it's out got a lot of detail in the and the characters, I'm pretty impressed by that. I mean, he's even got stubble on his face, so... It's rare, you know, in the, that day and age, it was rare to have that much detail. Usually, the stubble on people's faces looked really like it was painted on. This looks horrible in 3D. Sorry, guys. Too bad. I can't stand bugs. And that doesn't work in 3D as well. <laughs> oh well. <sighs> Only really the far shots are the ones that are going to be pretty good. Huh? This is horrible right here. What the fuck? That is a thing. Ah! That's a nice shot. Sort of escape pod for herself. Hmm. I'm sure this would be a lot smoother if it weren't for the 3D. But... 
actually, you know, when I was playing it with uh, the NVIDIA 3D Vision glasses, it, it seemed like it was a lot smoother, so maybe the Anaglyph 3D slows it down, I'm not sure. Games react differently to different kinds of 3D. Who was that? Serious guns everywhere, just like she does. It's her future self. <laughs> you? What's the matter, Bayonetta? All that sleeping made you soft. <laughs> A rival witch lady. Sure, if this is supposed to be sort of in slow motion. It's like that because of the 3D. I think it's supposed to be in slow motion because you can see cars and stuff floating around. I think this is sort of a competition as well, where you're trying to kill more of these than she is. But I'm not sure. It was even. Sort of like on Dark Siders when you kill all the, the angels. Before the Scottish Gacking. The Forge Master. Oh yeah, <laughs> I forgot about that. I'm taking all of these things. I don't know how you do that move, but it happens sometimes. Oh, no. <laughs> Good thing it was in slow motion. Though. Boom! That's purple blood everywhere. <laughs> You're never gonna hit me with that in slow motion. That's a really, really stupid. Wow, I've got him anyway. I think if you pull off a certain amount of combos or something, it, it does that thing where you throw them into the Iron Maiden. I don't remember. It'll tell you later, I think. There we go. There it goes. I did it. Okay, now what? This is some weird music. I actually thought that the music would be changed once they put it on PC. But no. Looks like it's the same old music. Like on the PS3. Uh oh. This is the time where. Oh wow. <laughs> I thought I was gonna get hit, but no. Which hunts are over? Oh no. Oh, I was supposed to kill everybody before we crashed? Is that what? That was weird. Huh. Well, I'll try to fight faster then. Fight faster, not harder. Oh, that was cool. <laughs> Get them out of this guy. Doing pretty well now. Doing the Lord's work. Oh, <laughs> I guess not. <laughs> Sorry. Actually, I always wondered in video games why you didn't get to be the bad guy because the bad guys usually lose in most pieces of art or whatever, you know, like movies or whatever. I think there was sort of a kind of a unwritten rule that in the movies the bad guy's always lost somehow. The murderers always got killed or whatever, you know. And so I always thought, in video games, you should be the bad guy because you always lose, it seems. Game over! You know. And so in this game, it kind of makes some sense. 
In a way, because you're always getting killed. What in the world was that? <laughs> that was a cool combo, whatever that was. Don't know how I did it. Double team. I think we're doing pretty well this time. Hopefully. It's probably not easy to structure it that way. Yeah. That's what I was thinking too. I always wish that I could be the ghosts in Pac-Man. How you doing, Ice Wolf? Welcome. Oh, oh. I think I got hit. I don't know. Oh, maybe not. Maybe I was hitting him. <laughs> yeah, killing them with their own guys. Oh, I did get hit that time. Oh, I to oh I got hit again. Darn it. Wow, nice combo there. I gotta learn some of the combos, I guess. I don't know. Seem to be doing well without knowing what I'm doing. <laughs> oh no! What are we supposed to do? Jump off? I don't understand. The game is not telling me what. The game's not telling me what to do. I'm supposed to jump off. trouble when I played it on PS3. This part was pretty easy. What I remember. The first boss was even easy, I think. Well, mini boss, it's not really a boss. Obviously, you're not trying to fight the other witch, maybe. Boom. Okay, this is significant right here. I don't know what it means, though. Just that boss. I'm trying to jump off. Alright. I'm going this way. Just in case I need to jump off. Game, what do you want me to do? I'm not sure. Hmm. I'm not sure what it wants. I'll just fight faster and see what happens. Kind of hard to fight fast when you're in slow motion, though. 
see anything in the background that might be some sort of clue let me know I'm not seeing anything there are no prompts on the screen or anything it looks like it it may be a oh look. huh okay it looks like it maybe it might be a quick time event or there might have been button things on the screen that I'm supposed to do, but I don't see anything. Did I get hit? Oh, there's guillotine. Wow. Heck, man. That's some weird combos. Unicorn horn. Alright. Useless by itself. Mandragora root. Well, at least I'm getting some items. I don't know if I get to keep them if I game over. about to do a combo and the plane just went right into the building. Hmm. Four skulls. I died four times. I really don't know. I don't know what's going on here. I might have to look this up on YouTube to see what's going on. Like I said, I don't remember having this much trouble with this part of the game on the PS3. So, I'm not sure if there's something missing. Maybe it's not displaying some buttons. Could be because it's in 3D that it... That I'm not seeing something I should be seeing. Because there was that cutscene where something invisible killed a whole bunch of people. And I have a feeling it wasn't supposed to be invisible. I did notice that if I had a certain setting in the graphics, that some things were invisible. So, that may be what what's going on. I may have to turn the 3D off for this part. But it does look awesome in 3D. Okay, if I die again, I'll probably turn the 3D off and, and try it in 2D and see if I'm missing something. If the thing that, that's not showing up on the screen will actually show up, that is. I mean, just having the 3D somewhat activated might be hindering whatever it is that we've seen. <laughs> the lady's just standing there. I don't know, let me stop you. Not that guy. I can't jump off the wings, I tried already. that cutscene. That didn't happen last time. Actually avoided that. Oh, we killed that guy. Can we jump off real quick? 
Doop. Can't jump off. Hey, I was jumping off. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna turn off the 3D for a moment and see what happens. All right, let me see. I think it's Control T. There we go. Now you guys without 3D glasses get to see what this actually looks like. You can see there are little kiss marks on the targeted enemies. They'll probably tell me about that later. It's kind of a funny thing. I think it's probably left uh, trigger or left button, shoulder button that probably does targeting. Like most games, like God of War or something. I'm hoping to see some screen pops now. Okay. Oh man, that's a new one. Okay, here's the guy that threatens or whatever. Alright. Okay, let's see whether I get some sort of weird taunt thing going. Oh, I just noticed there's no slow motion. Maybe the slow motion was made by the 3D, but it's not doing that ticking sound. And I think the ticking sound made the slow motion. Silver medal. Split, split. <laughs> and back to 3D. We have another problem with the game in 3D. I guess we'll find out. But notice how the ticking stopped and the slow motion went away when that one guy showed up and it was not in 3D. Kind of a weird thing. Strange. 3D doesn't usually change the game that much where you can't finish certain pieces and run into that. Maybe some things, I guess, that could be. As far as I remember. Better start driving. Oh. Thought there was a storm or something coming. The gates of hell. See, they have, those, have those assholes sure know how to get attention. ribbons and little, little medallions hanging off. Hotheads down home. You don't say. <laughs> and the buckles kind of flapping in it's the It's getting harder breeze. and harder to tell the worlds apart. <gasps> Human world. Our world. Inferno. <gasps> this is horrible 3D right here. Paradiso. Who can tell the difference? Ah. Even harder with Purgatorio in the middle. Fight long enough in there and you'll really lose sight. <laughs> Why the sudden interest in metaphysics? It's a balance, right? Even if some of them like messing around with the humans, we've all got a stake in the status quo. But people keep fucking around like this, the, the book Jar -Jar of revelations is gonna look like Mother Goose. Heaven and hell are gonna go straight to each other's throats. Please. This isn't working. 
Heaven and hell can tear each other to pieces for all I care. I've got my own problems to worry about. Something's up. Everything was a bit too bracing. And Enzo's tip makes the timing too perfect. This reeks of a setup. Someone in one of those lost memories calling you out. Now this store opens. I got a little present for Except you. I probably don't have enough money for him. These much of anything. Oh, I get new guns though, I think. Built from an alloy the devil himself would kill to get his hands on. Hmm. Don't break these. Cause they're one of a kind. Oh please, don't put your face that close to the camera. Or the guns. This is a little thing they call target practice. <laughs> what the crap? Okay, that was disturbing. <laughs> They were gonna shoot the bottles Calling and stuff. Out. I don't go in for strange offers. She wants a small drink then and again, a large gun. <laughs> I'm getting a little tired of these weaklings they keep throwing at me. Maybe I should aim for something a bit more high class. Ah, that's horrible in 3D. Pounding them down tonight, baby. Not to butt into your affairs, but I'm pretty sure you got somewhere better to be. The guys you're up against aren't the type to wait for you to finish a round. <laughs> Speaking of which... Enzo, her drinks are going on your tab, buddy. <laughs> <sighs> you did beat, motherfucker. I know. <laughs> Yeah, some of the 3D is just really horrible. But, you know, this game was never intended to be 3D. It didn't know. Whoa. Oh, <laughs> that was game. pretty cool. You got a stone award. Or a stoned award. Thinking that, uh, speaking of that guy, whatever. Ladies and gentlemen, if what you've been waiting for... Angel attack. Angel What the heck? How to play Angel Attack. Aim and fire on the Angel targets to rack up a high score in this thrilling shooting game for each arcade arcade bullet, not arcane bullet. In your possession, you may fire three times during the game. Hitting multiple. All this time I thought it was arcane. <laughs> um, or Aiming, hitting vital points on the targets to earn bonus. If you set the, or yeah, if I set the high score on this machine, you will be handsomely rewarded. Developed and distributed by Naughty Friends at Platinum Game. Yeah, LSD. Oh, Maria. Dang it! <laughs> I'm not doing well. I got missed. And missed again. There we go. I'll just wait till they come to me. There we go. That's probably better. Oh, I missed them. Oh, I thought he was going to go higher than that. Oh, well. Oop. Well, that was bad. Okay, so we got nothing. Not enough. That was stupid. Okay, so what do I do? I can't buy anything. Oh, I can exchange for... Yeah, I guess I'll exchange halos. Psh. What 
whatever. Okay. This game is so weird. <laughs> it's gonna get weirder. Go fish to you, fish to you. And that is short for. Oh, well, hmm. It's a drug. So, it's an acid drug. I around and some whale in Europe is trying to fence a huge rock on the black market. Yeah, sometimes it, it it's the pretty right bad. Eye. Saying it's part of some set called the eyes Yeah, of the see, world. I don't even know Fits what the, the drug is. I know that it's a, an acid. Now, here's when people the say drop bit. acid, that's the what they're talking about. The stone passes around the halls of power for hundreds of years. Vanishes. And then the black market goes white hot for the thing. But the seller wanted an arm and a leg for it. To the point no one could stomach the price. So back goes the stone. But not before everyone figures out where the guy is. <laughs> You're gonna enjoy doing this one, I bet. I love sticking it to the rich. Of course, when you do, don't forget your old buddy Enzo stuck his neck out on this one. Slide me a few fuzzles out of the rich guy's pocket for my troubles, right? Anyways, yeah, you except get then you'll be rich and people will be sticking it to you. So, to the middle of what's nowhere? the point? Paradise of Europe. Vigley. It makes you see funny colors and shapes. <laughs> I wouldn't know, but I've heard. I could tell. <sighs> yeah, definitely these cut screens are. Really horrible, even if you do have 3D glasses on. Like this right here is really painful. That part's not too bad. It's a little bit bad, but but when they get up close like this, where they're getting really close, it gets really spread apart and it's really horrible. Hmm. Trust me, you don't want to. Yeah, I've heard tell that too. <laughs> that scene's not too bad right there. Oh yeah, head off. This is where you go into this kind of like another world where, yeah, where there are people that are ghostly. I can hardly hear what that guy's saying. That's a pretty cool scene. Texture on that train needs a little bit of a tweaking, but, you know, it was probably 2008 or whatever when this game came out, so. I don't know, like I said, so, I'll have to look it up. This is supposed to be paradise? Mm, I don't think so. I think this is so... I think there's all kinds of stuff. Yeah, you can get... You can get things. If you look around here. When did I start taking acid? I don't know. When did you? <laughs> ah, I'm almost done, guys. It's 9 o'clock already. Maybe next time I play this, I won't play it in 3D, but I just was determined to play it in 3D because the first time I played it on PS3, I was just going, man, this would be so cool in 3D. But now you know why I like to have a 3D TV, because then you don't see all this weird red and blue stuff. You just see the game in 3D, and it looks awesome. Oh, that's a ghost person. A ghost person. Another ghost person. I never did drugs in my life, and I don't plan on it, but it feels like I'm on it. Yeah. Yep, same here. That's why I don't like Anaglyph 3D, actually. But it's the easiest way for a general public to be able to see 3D. I would have done split screen, but actually with the 
NVIDIA, I don't know if I can do split screen on Twitch. I can only do that when I'm doing uh, tri 3D. So, whenever I get this game in working in tri 3D, I don't know where I'm supposed to be going here. I must be... Yeah, this game's a little uh, dizzying on its own. But, you know what? I'm pretty much done right now. So, thanks guys for coming out, and maybe next time I'll just play it in 2D. Or, like I said, maybe I can get it working in split screen or something like that. That way you guys don't have to suffer with the weirdness. But anyway, that's the end of the stream. And until next time, keep your glasses on. Yep, have a good night, guys. Yeah, it was really good. I'm surprised that the uh, that the 3D didn't bother me so much as usual with the red and, and blue, except for the real close-ups in the in those cutscenes were pretty bad. Alright, see ya, Ice Wolf. Thanks for coming by.